I was trying not to be a complete poser with it, and that's why the background's so weird. But I feel like the background needs to be darker, because if I want to paint like Rembrandt, I need a I need to paint dark in the background like Rembrandt. But um, Rembrandt didn't do backgrounds like that. I don't know. It's weird because I feel like I'm connecting with my past lives every time I paint now because I, I get these um, pigments that people used to use way back in the day like raw umber or um, raw sienna. I haven't even used that one yet. Um, like um, terra verde, verde, which I haven't used yet. Um, terra roja, which it's like because they're colors that were mined in certain areas and you can still get them to this day because it's like um, colors mined from Italy um, so when you paint with them it's like you're painting with your colors of past life but in, in this I actually have a cadmium red and a crimson and I, I feel like that's not really working but I don't really know it's, it's an undercoat no matter what but I, I kind of want him to glow, which he's not glowing yet because I'm not using the colors. I don't have enough colors yet. Um, I don't know, but it's kind of fun because once I paint this, then I then I can paint a big ass one of whatever I want to paint, which I would paint Katy Perry pregnant wearing super colorful clothes or Grimes wearing something crazy, but I'd want to photograph them somewhere cool and then try to do it and then make them big but they don't have to be big um, some people might not want to have a big old pregnant picture but if you're if it's full body it needs to be big yeah so if running for president doesn't work out, I think I could probably do portraits because this is the undercoat. This isn't done. Um, you kind of, with oil painting, you beat it into submission. But um, number one, it seems like everyone's out of oil paints. You can't even buy it nowadays. So everyone go run. Everyone buy oil paint. That's we all, it's like, we're out of toilet paper. We're out of oil paint. No. Okay. The other problem is, if you paint with oil paint, you will destroy your house. So um, you should be able to do with acrylics what you do with oil paint, almost. But I like oil more. But this is just, I don't know what to do with the background. I don't know. I know a long time ago I said a baker should be able to turn down a gay couple. But I also said only if it's like a very custom cake. Not if it's, um, if there's a form you fill out with the names on it, um, that's not very custom. But if it's two grooms or something, or if like, if the, if, cause I believe that you shouldn't be able to, you shouldn't force someone who's religious to do something that is against their morals. Um, but that person shouldn't force their government to tell Elton John what his morals should be or what his belief system should be or to tell him that he can't love a certain person. So I just like I don't think the the gay people have a right to infringe on the religious people's rights. I also don't believe the religious people have a right to infringe on the gay people's rights. And so if we have a secular government, then you should be for gay marriage. And um the fact that you're not um means you don't believe in equal rights because he should have the same rights that you should have. And he, I mean, hopefully he believes that Christians should have the same rights he has. And so but for the most part, um, I, I believe the government should stay out of people's business as far as religion goes, unless the religion is doing something dangerous like um, a church's meeting and that could threaten everyone else's health. So that's like, the only time I really believe that uh, you you have to give up your religious freedom is when um, the science is telling us you will be a danger to everyone 
if you don't give up your religious freedom, which is your freedom to go to church and get infected by a disease possibly, when everyone's working so hard to slow it down. So anyways, yeah, I want to open up a shop. I think that in the future I want to try to paint more earthy, more with a limited palette like Rembrandt did.